They're at the post. And they're off in the Phoenix Wills Wildcat broke alertly. Some of the parts has early speed as well, and some of the parts comes right out for the early lead. Wills Wildcat goes second up on the outside. Dr. Chet third in between horses, followed by Cajun Breeze fourth toward the inside. There goes Dr. Chet up to press the issue now in second in between horses as they head for the far turn. Noble's Promise is in between horses as well, running in the fifth position four lengths from the front, and is followed by Night Party six down toward the inside. Laurie's Rocket goes seventh, and then Aiken Knight travels next to the eighth position. Hamiltonian next to last, and the late running Lonesome Street is last. Nine lengths off the lead. Midway on the far turn. 22 and three-fifths seconds for the opening quarter. Some of the parts leading Dr. Chet by three parts of a length around the far turn. Wills Wildcat third up on the outside. Three lengths off the lead. Long shot Cajun Breeze looking forth toward the inside. Laurie's Rocket angles wide from the fifth position. And Aconite and Lonesome Street both expected to arrive on the scene later. Swinging out toward the center of the track. But they've got to catch some of the parts. And some of the parts has a five-length lead. Dr. Chet not able to stay with him and Laurie's Rocket goes to second sum of the parts rolling past the 16th pole late run from Noble's Promise no catching some of the parts who takes the Phoenix for Julianne Laparou followed under the line by Noble's Promise and Laurie's Rocket Unofficial results of Keeneland's eighth race. Six, some of the parts was first. Seven, Noble's Promise in the photo was second. Ten, Laurie's Rocket third. One, Aconite fourth. Six, seven, ten, one, unofficial.